the project setup is a basic express application and generated with express generator uh, the project is also available in the github and um, so as you see there is a grunt file out here in the root of the project which starts the server and restarts the server and um, uh, watches for changes in the files and then restarts so this file actually utilizes the server which spawns a server every time when the grunt calls this function so when i execute this uh, code with uh, node inspector i am actually able to uh, debug it to the fullest so let's try so my node inspector is running out here now i'll just run the server and one more thing to note that when i'll be running this grunt task with node inspector environment variable it will also run in the debug mode so i'll use the same variable out here i can pass anything star out here so that's all so you can see that the debugger is listening on port 5858 so let's go back here maybe i'll reload it once again okay so here i can see my source out here so let's go to my app.js or maybe i'll go in the route so index.js and i'll put a breakpoint out here so i can see that uh, the breakpoint is actually out here and only if i pass the breakpoint you can see the page is loaded so it is uh, that simple uh, nothing fancy out here so i'm trying to achieve the same thing with the uh, code so let me stop the process out here the code is already opened up in the code and i have created a launched on dot json out here and if you see i'm running the program user local pin grant i'm passing the argument as a start and i'm also passing the node inspector environment variable so let me start it out here so hopefully it will open up terminal and it is all listening here so it has actually gone to the grunt part so it's fair enough let me pass through this i'm coming back to my explorer going to my routes the same thing what i have done in the other file i'm trying to set up a breakpoint out here and uh, notice that this breakpoint is not actually attached this this code is not attached to the uh, visual studio code though i have a breakpoint it's not actually stopping out here so the whole thing uh, is that is it possible to uh, debug such kind of application which has been started from a spawned uh, child process uh, if yes what should be done and if no will visual studio code uh, try to incorporate this kind of functionalities thank you